We are All live right. in now. Hello. Sorry, that was a little bit Zero. of. We clipped in for battery charge. Hello, double chestman again. Fuck you, chestman. Octillery. Now you have a hollow room right in a hollow octillery. Wait. Room right evolves into octillery, right? Yes. Okay. No, I was. I, I don't know why I thought Mantine for a minute. I forgot about Mantike. Oh, I fucked it up. You fucked it up. I fixed it. You fucked it up. Apologies to those who just got. Show Octillery's ability. Oh, it's it's a ability. really good ability. So I'm going to try and put it up here. Once during your turn before you may attack, uh, you can. I'm trying to read it through the blindness. You may draw cards and you have five in your hand. There it is. Oh, now it comes up. There it is. It also knows it, it, its attack is hug. If anyone can retreat during your opponent's exit. <gasps> oh, that's adorable. Octillery, go hug him. With your abyssal hands. That yeah, actually. That's, that's not right. That sounds extremely creepy. Tentacle porn. This is definitely not a PG rated show. <laughs> Marowak. I don't know why it looks Waba like it. Magnet. What the hell's that? Reserve ticket. Flip a coin. If heads, search your deck for a card. Shuffle your deck. Then put it. Put that card on top of it. Wow. Let's see if that'll. Pop. Yep, got it. You guys can pause it at that specific moment if you guys need to see that, because that would keep. So it's, so it's pretty much top deck a card from your deck. All right, where are the hollows? I want to see another one. There should be another one. We've easily got another hollow somewhere. I mean, there's like eight packs left. Right here. This, Found it, really? This, oh. This is hollow. Two, three, four, five, six. You got seven, and that's eight. This is a nice hollow, too. I hope it's 104. I'll be uh, 164. I'll be super happy. Jeez. No, it's not. Marowak. Houndoom EX. Wow! It looks nice! But it's not full art. It's extended. Fuck. Oh, cool. Lava. So, it looks like Melting Horn. Discard top two cards of your opponent's deck, which is one fire energy, and then two fire energies. It has a fire energy from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon, and it does 50 damage. Retreat cost of two, HP of 170. Standard EX. Uh, not really standard, but useful. Definitely One, useful. Well, 170 HP standard EX. Oh yeah, HP standard, yes. I like its first ability to just discard top two cards of your opponent's deck. Like, if you're first turning and your opponent goes first, and then you just put an energy down, you just start discarding your opponent's cards and accidentally mill their mega they need. Ooh, bat. Gotta make that scatterbug deck. Grand Bull, another Raikou. What? Bullshit. Fuck you, Raikou. I mean, now we can Another build... fire energy. We can absolutely build a Raikou deck. I know we have a bunch of special thunder energies. I don't remember what the special thunder energy does, though. I think it's like a plus 20 defense. If it is, Raikou plus special thunder energy. Stupid. Just get four special thunder energies on it. <laughs> You fuck it up again? Yep. Nice. Twice. Nice. <laughs> Toss these in here. So we could easily go and add. We're definitely thinking about making a Raikou break Ra deck. Well, Raichu. Raichu. Raichu break Ra deck. Well, it's going to include Raikou. Most well, likely. Well, that's not a Raikou break. You pointed to Raichu and said Raikou break. They're very similar. They, they are. They I'm, understand. I, I've actually made that mistake in the past. I can't even be upset with you. There it is. There's the Froakie with, with the Frogadier in the background. Frogadier in the background. Another. Hug me. I want somebody to build that deck and just have like some sort of Pokemon that just says, "Don't hug me. I'm scared." I almost did it again. You done fucked up. All right. Tell us. Uh... Four, five packs left. It's okay. Well, the other one was seven minutes long, and this is four, so... Well, now it's gonna be five. Um... Yeah. What is going on? Uh... Audience, if you guys would like, also post below if you guys enjoyed uh, seeing a first uh, sneak peek preview of the new set uh, of an entire box, not just some packs. Oh, there's the other one! Man, you got 103 and 104! Alright, I'll try and zoom that in. Um... You know, Scattershot, one sec energy. Damn. And this attack does 3 damage times the amount of psychic energy attached to this Pokemon. Then, 
Two Psychic Energy, one Colorless. Switch all damage counters on this Pokemon with those, uh, with those on your opponent's active Pokemon. I don't see how that's a good card. But it is... If I can fucking zoom in. There it is. 164 of 162. It's got, uh, Chestnut. Oh, sorry. My bad. Chestnut. He's got Magnezone, and what looks like in the bottom... Never mind, I lied. I just know his leg looked like something. Uh, and Cresselia in the background at the top. Just leave it up, and ready to roll. So yeah, Cresselia's up there, Chestnut. With the leg of Chestnut all the way over here. Yeah, I know, I could I don't know why. It looked like another Pokemon in the bottom left. Put that right next to that. Man. I wonder how much they go for. Like 10 bucks a piece, I think we looked at them yesterday. Not like anyone's gonna ever use them, but I mean, it's one of a kind. It's, it's like a promo card where like it's really nice to have, not very useful. Yeah, I mean, it's they are one sixty three and one sixty four of one hundred two, one sixty two, which is really weird. Yeah. I want to hear the story behind why somebody decided to make that. Aww. Xerneas. You don't have Geomancy, no? Okay. No. Good. At some point, I I thought they were gonna make something useful again. Another Bridget. Uh, let me just give you a heads up on this Pokemon card right here. This attack does 30 more damage for each different type of Pokemon on your bench. And power creation, It uh, if this Pokemon is healed during this turn, this card does to 80 more damage. So you can do 160 damage with this Pokemon. Or, um, you know, five Pokemon on the bench that are all different types somehow. Oof, 160? I mean, it is possible, but no one wants to run that. Got another Pikachu. Pikachu! Inky, inky. It's fucking Chestnut. I mean, uh, Chespin. I'm sick of running into Chespin. It's a piece of shit. Alright, so we got two packs remaining. Hopefully we can pull... That's actually a lot of hollows. So yeah, no, you... I mean... Hopefully, maybe, maybe one more. Maybe you please. Right, maybe right. Uh, Zoro, uh, Zoroark break. You know that that break card that we've been looking for. You know that useful thing. Or maybe a fucking Zoroark reverse hollow. Oh yeah, we didn't get a Zoroark either. I'm sick of this town map crap. Come on. Believe. We. I don't think either one of us got the card that we actually needed. <laughs> Like, he needs Zoroark Break to build a Zoroark deck that he wants to build, and I needed Shaman to build my Rayquaza deck, but no. There's a nice hollow in this. Oh, yeah. So we're ending on a high note. You don't know that. Yes. <laughs> Must be another fucking Raichu break. Oh, it's so adorable. Oh, Mewtwo. Mega Mewtwo Y. What number is that? 160? 160 out of 162. Oh, I guess. Let's that is nice. Let's find out what you ultimately do. But I will first, so you will. So, uh, Mega Evolution, very good. And then it's got Psychic Infinity. Because that doesn't sound like a badass move. This card does 30 more damage times the amount of energy attached to both active Pokemon. This... What? Read it. This a... Well, I just did. Uh, this attack is not affected by weakness. So, if you can get into Mega Mewtwo EX that has 210 health, it can then do 10 damage automatically. But as 30 more times the amount of energy attached by Pokemon, you have to have two on it to use this attack. So at a minimum, it does 70. But if you put like a double special, a, a double colorless, it can do fucking, what's it called, 130 plus your opponent's damage. This fucker can take out anything in like one hit. This is like Lugia, but better. Actually, Lugia doesn't have to evolve. But regardless, I mean, like, that's not okay. That is not okay. Ooh, Halo had the video. We have to go over a recap. Recap time. Okay. So we're just gonna quickly flip through. Yeah, we're at the 17. So guys, uh, tell us what you like about these new cards. Tell us your favorite card. That's awesome. Uh, tell us your favorite cards. Tell us uh, what you guys believe is going to be a new deck of the meta with Breakthrough being a thing. 
if you guys don't know how breakthrough works, I did go over it in part one, so you guys can go back to that. I will post, uh, I will put a little annotation and a uh, link in the description so you guys can hop back to that if you ended up watching this first, just to see the uh, overall collection at the end, which uh, we always do, you know, and which everyone does. We always just watch the end of the video to see all the cool things that actually can come in this box. Uh, yeah, it's loaded up. Um... All your support is awesome for us. We love seeing you guys, you know, post comments, show us, give us a little love, tell us what you guys like. And, um, man, these break. I, I swear to God, like, its face looks like Alakazam. Florgus is probably the most powerful out of all of them. I mean, Zoroark probably does something. I just don't know about. A little lower. To me. There you go. We got that so early on that I forgot we got it. And then that's just fucking beautiful. So, uh, guys, remember, like, subscribe, and uh, tell us what you guys like. Uh, we're going to be doing a whole bunch of early shot videos of uh, new packs and sets that come out. Um, as you do so, you know, we gotta know what you guys want us to do it. Or you can hate us, that's fine too. Oh yeah, that's our little set of uh, what needs to break through. Cause they're breaking free, soaring, flying. Shut the fuck I'm up. I'm sorry. Bye, guys.